In this video, we'll walk through granting access to SiteDocs accounts. You can grant your workers access to SiteDocs from their worker profiles. At the bottom of the page, you can see that there are three levels of access in SiteDocs. Simply select the level of access that each user needs. App Access gives the user access to the SiteDocs mobile app and also the SiteDocs web app but not the administrator panel, which is the page that we're looking at right now. If you select app access, you'll get a window where you can enter the worker's email address. This does need to be a functioning email address as any password resets will be sent to this email address. Next, you'll get a window where you can either set a password for your worker manually, or you can send them an email to set up their own password. If you have multiple SiteDocs accounts, Use the email option, as that enables the email for multi-account login. We'll go over that a little bit later in the video. The next level is Admin Access. This gives the user access to the mobile app and the web app, but also access to the administrator panel. When you select this access level, you'll only have the option to send an email to set up their password. The last level is Super Admin Access. This level is almost exactly the same as admin access, but with one big difference. Super admins have the authority to grant and revoke admin and super admin access for other users. This permission has a lot of power, and as we all know, with great power comes great responsibility. So we recommend using this permission only for your safety administration team. This level of access also only has the option for a password setup email. If you're working with a single SiteDocs account, then that's it. Your users are now set up with access to your account. If you have any questions about granting access or anything else in SiteDocs, please reach out to our awesome support team at support at sitedocs.com. But if you have multiple SiteDocs accounts, we'll now take a look at granting multi-account access. Once an email has been used in one account, you can activate access to another account in a similar way to the first one. When you select the access level you'd like to grant in the new account, you'll get the same email address confirmation window. But after you enter the email address, you'll be given a window with a simple Grant Access button. However, if this email has not been enabled for multi-account use yet, you may get a window with a message that contains a link to enable the email address for multi-account use. Selecting the link will send a confirmation email to the user where they can confirm their email address and reset their password. The password can be the same as their old one, it just needs to be entered a second time to confirm their identity. Once the password has been reset, multi-account login can be granted. When multi-account login has been set up, the user will see multiple company names in the Choose Account screen when they log into the mobile or web app or the administrator panel. They will also now have a switch account button on the administrator panel, the mobile app, and the web app. And that's all there is to it. Now your workers have full access to your SiteDocs accounts. If you have any questions about setting up access or anything else in SiteDocs, please reach out to our amazing support team at support at sitedocs.com.